the smoking bear is real pit barbecue. You don't see no coals or anything, we're going straight to Hickory Wood right here. Real pit barbecue. Gotta clean the first. <clears throat> All right, our chicken is ready. It's one whole chicken, I'm gonna put it in two halves. And we're gonna season this up with Big Mo Cakes on Chicken Rub, baby. The winner. You always go winners, not losers, and only listen to people who have made it, not the ones who still trying. Very good stuff right here. I wouldn't use anything else. On this beautiful yard bird. We're gonna add a couple more things to it. Give it a little more spice and we're gonna move on to a jerk chicken. And you'll see the difference. The way my smoke and smoke is very humid. That's why my meat turned out so great due to the fact that it's not dry heat. There's a huge difference. Uh, yeah, we gotta get you, put you some deodorant up under there. Stay right there. Get some deodorant up under them arms. So I know y'all looking like, damn, that's gonna be salty. No, sir. I know exactly what's in this rub, and it works exactly how I'm applying it. Believe it or not. All right, that buddy. I did a catering one time. And I went through a whole case of this one night. And the chicken was falling apart. And people was like, damn, who the hell made this? It's time. This chicken is gonna cook for three hours on the top level on Thanos. So it's gonna get some real hickory smoke flavor because that's what we cooking on tonight. The longest cook is gonna be the pork loins and the butterfly pork loins. That's a four and a half hour to five hour cook. So it'll probably be about midnight when that's done. But it's gonna be amazing, buddy. Get your in arms. Yeah. Damn. gonna be beautiful. Let's get your open hand on that side. You and your big brother right there. Good size chicken, Tyson brand. So we're gonna move over here and grab these for our jerk chicken, which actually I'm gonna use these two. I'm not gonna use Big Mo with the jerk. So give me a second, let me clean this cutting board off and get these back over there. Almost hooked up. Damn it, boy. All I gotta do is get the damn video to stop. Yeah, I'm on my phone. I'm on my fingers wet. What shit is that? Trying to invest money in your damn phone, because apparently, that shit tripping. A lot of people say don't show you no secrets. This is my video pattern. This one I'm gonna do. I want I know you wonder what this griddle is for, and I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna take this fully seasoned big mo on chicken rub, two halves of chicken, and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put it in here and I'll show you how I want first place in chicken. I'm gonna take this up just like this, and I'm gonna add my mango nectar under here, on this pan for the under flavor. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take both of these, put it on this griddle, put it out there on Thanos, and then when it's done about an hour and a half later, and it's still not gonna be done, I'll take that back, and then we're gonna bring it in here, and we're gonna put it in there, and it's over. Yeah, damn it. All right, this chicken is fully seasoned right here, with big bump paste on, chicken rub right here. Outstanding. Now, I put the two jerks together. <laughs> the two jerks together, that's a good one. But. My brother-in-law, Brian, in Chicago, he makes his own homemade dry jerk seasoning. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook half of each, and we're going to go with his jerk dry rub, and we're going to go with Tony Graham, Dookie Jam, AG Born Jamaican. Look him up on YouTube right there with his jerk sauce with pepper straight out of the garden. So we're going with his wet rub right here. So we're going to do the dry and the wet rub, and they'll be separated great out there on Thanos because it's a huge smoker because we need room for the pork loins and the butterfly pork loin, which is gonna be cooked in the pan first and then put on high heat. So I can save the juices to reapply it later. So let's get this out there, let's go. All right, back in the house. Temperature 350, we got almost got less than 45 minutes left on this smoked baked chicken. Damn it, boy. 
Tell me they ain't beautiful. Damn it, boy. That's how it's supposed to be right there. Let's let this keep going. We gotta put the foil on to hold in that mango heat. Let's go. All right, I got the chicken out of the oven. This is the bottom and this is the top with that amazing crust right there. Look at that, amigo. Outstanding. This is the bottom and this top. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put foil over this to hold in that mango steam. That's what is gonna make it happen right there, buddy. And this wing will be able to pull right off. Let's get this going, put it back in there for the duration. I'll add six more minutes to this, make it 45 minutes, and it should be a banger. Let's do it. All right, let's put this back in there. And this is gonna be amazing, buddy. 45 minutes, 350. Wait, I gotta take a look at that again. God damn it. Oh, oh, I almost thought I was Prince right there. God damn, I'm so excited. Let's go, buddy. All right, for all you watch my videos, y'all know we're big broccoli eating family. So we got the big broccoli and the French sliced green beans right here. Damn it. I can't help it. I gotta have some butter, goddamn. I'm gonna have some flavor to it. Let's go. Hour and a half later, smoked baked chicken is out. Damn it, boy. Bones coming out of it right now. Let's do a wing test. Damn it. Right there, buddy. Smoke to the bone. Drop the mic. Yeah, damn it. It's over. Let's keep this cook going. Look at it. There you have it, YouTube, your smoked baked chicken right there. Look at it. Outstanding. Two hour smoke, hour and a half in the oven. Couldn't do any of it. I made a hot life. Champagne to be his guy. Look at it. Outstanding. It's on the menu. Let's keep this cook going. All right, guys, everything is vacuum sealed already. All those lines of the smoke smoke for eight and a half hours last night, they're right here in vacuum sealed in its au jus. Just like this. This is how it comes packaged, vacuum sealed. Just if you got it from the store. Now, this is different in color right here because we requested that way. The short end of the loin and the thick end of the loin, just like this. Outstanding. And the parts in pieces, Food request it just like burning them on a brisket, just like that. Amazing. And also the butterfly ones, they are going out. All these are going to four different stages. 